Welcome back again, and I hope you're enjoying the Bubble Battle Bash here, uh, sponsored and with and partnered with uh, Poseidon and Extra Life. So thank you so much for hanging out so much with us. That's and you're joined right. by got... a Frozen Hot Sauce. I'm so sorry. Yeah, and Summer with me. That's right. The Frozen <laughs> and the Hot. Well, actually, I guess that's my whole gig. But either way, <laughs> we're here today with 49er hot off the front lines, was fighting with his brothers in the Imperium, came down to spend a moment so we could ask him a few question bouts, his uh, VR adventures. So oh. without further ado, should we hand it over 49er? Would you take it away with our first question? How are you doing, 49er? Hey guys, great to meet. Great to be here. I'm doing all right. It's a nice break to get off the front line. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Good, good. Battle in space is going okay. Yeah, aside from the constant death, blood, and destruction, everything's fine. Good. You said blood and destruction? Yeah, just a lot of death, a lot of blood, a lot of destruction, people dying left and right, but it's just another damn battle. Well, we've got some battles coming to us here in our bubble battle bash, but. As far as the uh, Space Marines go, what's your favorite chapter? Well, um, officially, I'm with the uh, Blood Ravens, officially. Mm -hmm. But homebrew, I consider myself to be an angry Marine. <laughs> I love it. An angry Marine? What, what, what angry. does this mean by chance? I'm not actually familiar with a lot of the terms that you're using. Um, um, out of um, lore-wise, they're a fan-made group of Space Marines that brandish yellow armor that are just known for their unbridled rage and inability to operate mentally. So they're like internet trolls. 4chan if they were made into a Space Marine chapter. <laughs> that explains a lot. <laughs> well, we're glad that you're not officially part of the Angie Marines and are running with Blood Ravens <laughs> instead. But we've got a couple more VR-related questions for you, Summer. I'll let you take it away. Uh, it what has actually led you to uh, VR chat in general? Well, I first I got my first VR headset, the uh, Oculus Rift S, back in 2019 when I was um when I graduated. Oh. <clears throat> was it like my a aunt... gift or something? Yeah, it was a graduation gift from my aunts when I went to Rhode Island. Oh, cool! Ooh. And Lucky. then I um the first the first ever VR game I ever played was um a virtual shooting range called Hot Dogs, Horses, and Hand Grenades. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I keep seeing a lot more of my friends and a fellow colleagues play that from time to time, and it does look yeah, very it's interesting, great. but it is kind of terrifying with like how many ghost-looking things that you have to try to be in the lookup for to murder <laughs> before There's they murder dogs, you. Though. You, you know? got hot dogs. How bad could it be? <laughs> They're literally robot hot dogs. <laughs> I mean, come on, yeah. <laughs> Outstanding. Well, so you've been in VR, you've been into war. What about fighting games? What's your story with fighting games? What got you into them? What's some of your favorites or maybe a favorite character? Tell us your story on fighters. The first time I ever played a VR game was um, Mortal Kombat. I forgot what it was, but it was like a pretty old Mortal Kombat. I think it was in an arcade machine, actually. Oh, cool. Mm. Back in um, Nevada. And oh, that was super. like at least 10, that was like 10 years ago. Then I um I got um an Xbox One X and I started getting into the uh, Dragon Ball Z fighting games. Hey, we Ooh. got a couple of fans of those. Now, I heard you talking about another type of fighting game earlier, too, that uh we, we should pay some lip service to, because it's not one that's talked about very much. In fact, yeah. it was really cool that you you mentioned it. Yeah, it was um Gundam Extreme versus Mac Bo Max Boost on. I um the first time I played that was over at a a convention last December, and right. it had an arcade port. Mm. Yes, and you and had to a, represent. Um, yeah, it was a one thousand dollar tournament prize. Oh, oh holy snap. fuck! And I came Did in at fifth. Ah. I came in fifth. I, <laughs> Listen, <laughs> that was I'm close. That here, was man. Our prize pool isn't that big. Like, shoot. <laughs> listen, listen. It's, yeah, not, it's um, not about the prize pool. It's about the charity. Right. It is about the good time. The yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm, just, time. It. I'm just here for the fun. Mm. Amen, brother. That's what we're all here for. <laughs> and I um, I use the uh, full armor unicorn Gundam. There it is. Got to represent the unicorn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm actually planning on doing that as a cosplay um, a couple years from now. Oh, you cosplay? Yeah, I did. Oh, oh. Uh, do you mind naming off some things that you've uh, cosplayed before? My first ever cosplay was um, Light Yagami with my girlfriend of two years, I want to believe. Whoa. Before we, left, before we split up. Oh. Eh, so I'm over it. But um, this, <laughs> the second time and probably my so far personal best was a Nagisa Shiota from Assassination Classroom. Ooh, oh, you must have I love Nagisa. Nagisa's so cute. 
Ah! <laughs> you see, and I bet Sorry. this is exactly Sorry. the reaction Sorry. you got at the convention too. <laughs> yep. yep. I'm sorry. It's just whenever people actually bring up assassination classroom as well, above all, not a lot of people knew about it, especially when I came back from uh, actually being there in Japan for the short time that I was there. Well, I was there twice for a couple times, but um, <laughs> when I wanted to come back and talk about it, people were like, "What the fuck are you talking about? Like anime and the alien octopus looking thing? Kids have to try to shoot it." I'm like, "Yes, this is a thing that is made and it's really good." Heck, I actually <laughs> even have the actual knife. Like, I actually oh, had my best friend Ooh. make a foam knife like that. Nice, well, there nice, you nice. go, fighting space marines and alien octopus. You've got a oh, whole nice. skill set. What brought you to Poseidon, my friend? We're mm -hmm. happy to have you here in the pond with us. What got you into this whole club? Well, um, I've somehow, by sheer chance, the uh, Instagram page showed up on my um on my feed. <laughs> okay. And I was looking go for ahead, some way to get Poseidon out of my Instagram um, page. I was still kind of shy to the whole VR thing. Mm. I figure why not find a good place, meet some people, and have some fun. I mean, that's and, what and, we do and, here. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, and the Poseidon, the Poseidon Instagram poster was the thing that did it, wasn't it? <laughs> and I mean, that's that's what they, so some of these are gonna be going. You might be watching this on Instagram right now, so shoot, you know, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> represent. Well, we. Yep. How did you get your in-game name, the one that you use for uh, VR? Well, this is actually my go-to username. I mean, I was a, I'm still a Star Wars nerd, but um, when I was a little kid, I was like all about those uh role-play groups, mm -hmm. and uh, that was my number when I was a trooper. Oh. So you you actually wore nice. like the We've trooper with like number. a number on it and stuff. It wouldn't show the number on the sh shoulder, but that's how everyone knew me as CT4949. Oh, nice. That's hey, you got a shout out for the squadron. I mm. like it. It's super cool. It's Ultra Pug, Max Pug, <laughs> if we're doing the Gundam Max Turbo, mm. whatever it was. Well, thank you, 49er, for your time with us. All y'all that are still watching with us, make sure you head to the donations page, get your raffle tickets, and vote for whatever team you think is going to win. The combo clams or the rollback rays. Doesn't matter who wins the grand prize, because everybody in the winning team gets a surprise at the end. And more importantly, mm. this is to help many of people who need that charity money. Amen. We, yes. Amen. Yes, yes, yes. So go ahead and check out those uh, links, exclamation mark, uh, extra life, exclamation mark, charity, or exclamation mark, dono. One of those three should probably be the link. Uh, and uh, they'll probably pop up a little website link that you can click on to directly donate. Uh, uh, either on your mobile devices or on your computers or wherever you're watching because we appreciate ya. Um, and if you also would like to check out Club Poseidon, please do an exclamation mark, exclamation mark, discord, or exclamation mark, uh, Poseidon. And uh, I should also bring them up. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for coming on with us, 49er. And we hope to see you in, in the games. And I hope you keep, keep having fun. Yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs>